gotten older, the crowd's younger, the voice a little softer, but the music's still just as sweet near Bourbon Street. A full house for the man in the center, Lionel Furbos, believed to be the oldest working musician in New Orleans. Furbos bought his first cornet at a pawn shop at 15. Now he's the last living member of a band formed during the Depression. You know, that, that to us, when we hear it, we think, that's a long time. But when you talk to Lionel, you realize how quick a life goes. But the longevity has come at a price. Furbos has been in and out of the hospital in recent years. He had to start over after Hurricane Katrina. The most devastating loss, the deaths of his son and Marguerite, his wife of 75 years. Lionel, give us a thumbs up. That is Happy birthday. Okay, happy birthday. He is somebody that younger musicians should know about from the way that, that he shows up, the way he the way he is dressed, the way he cares for his horn, the way he plays his horn, the way his word is good. Lionel Furbos, now 102 years old and still humbled to be in the spotlight. Daisy Plaisons, Associated Press.